I'm Miklos Vasavelli. Uh, I'm a professor at Edgar's Business School. Um, and uh, I want to talk to you today about our work in the area of audit analytics and uh, big data and uh, data analytics. Uh, the, I am in the accounting department, we have the Accounting Research Center, and under the Accounting Research Center, we have the CALA, Continuous Audit and the Reporting Laboratory. Uh, the laboratory has been around for 15 years, the Research Center for 25, and uh, we basically serve a large audience of companies that work in experimental data analysis projects with us. Uh, these data analysis projects have the advantage of allowing our students and our faculty to uh, learn about real life type of problems and allow companies to understand and learn about uh, data analytics and uh, leading edge machine learning type of technology. Uh, the type of work that we have done, uh, which we call continuous auditing, is basically a layer of auditing on top of continuous monitoring. And uh, these days a lot of our work uh, benefits both for auditing and uh, continuous monitoring. Uh, this is actually a product of the real-time economy whereby immediate response is high premium for uh, better business decisions. Uh, the continuous auditing area, we divide them into three areas. One area we call continuous data audit, the second area we call it continuous control monitoring, the third area we call it continuous risk monitoring and assessment. And the idea is that you monitor risk and risk is a driver of the processes that need further attention, both by management and by auditing. For example, we have been doing projects with uh, Itauni Banco. Itauni Banco is one of the 10 largest banks in the world in certain measures. And uh, banking systems in Brazil are highly concentrated and they, because of the inflation surge they had there about 15 years ago, uh, clearances in one day and they are big, large, centralized computer systems, very good for analysis. Uh, we are doing projects that in the areas of insurance, uh, credit cards, transitory accounts, branch monitoring, uh, and many or, and several other projects. Uh, it's very interesting to work in a cross-cultural environment in Brazil uh, because we can bring in some of the U.S. analytic technology and adapt it to the local needs which sometimes are uh, different from what we have in the United States. The continuous auditing area uh, is an example of some of the areas at Rutgers, like supply chain, continuous auditing, government accounting, that uh, have a niche of leading uh, the world in analytic technology or in business thinking. Although we are in the accounting department, a sub-area of AIS, we actually bridge uh, the, uh, bridge disciplines uh, and work with different areas and different types of competences. We invite you to come and visit Rutgers and see the type of research we are doing.